Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I'm Shadi Aqeel. The commander of the National Guard, Lieutenant General Sheikh Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa, received today at his office the United Arab Emirates, the UAE Ambassador to Bahrain, Sheikh Sultan bin Hamdan bin Zayed Al Nahyan, in the presence of the Director of the National Guard, Major General Sheikh Abdul Aziz bin Saud Al Khalifa, and the Minister of Plenipotentiary at the UAE Embassy, Ali bin Yusuf Al Naimi. The National Guard commander hailed the deep rooted relation between Bahrain and the UAE. The two sides also discussed a number of joint interest topics related to the military. For his part, the UAE ambassador expressed appreciation to the National Guard commander for his efforts in developing the National Guard edifice and his contributions to preserving the gains of the kingdom, as well as his keenness to strengthen bilateral relations with the UAE. In implementation of the directives of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa to develop urgent solutions to reduce traffic congestion on Bahrain's main road network. The Minister of Works and Municipality Affairs and Urban Planning, Islam bin Abdullah Khalif, announced that the ministry has launched a development project at the intersection of Al Mahzura Road and the Istiqlal Road. The minister added that the action would facilitate traffic coming from Al Mahzura Road into Istiqlal Road by increasing the number of lanes on the latter to five. He noted that statistics indicate that the number of vehicles traveling on Istiqlal Road are about 50,000 in both directions daily, with an average of 3,200 vehicles per hour at peak time. He added that the project will reduce traffic congestion by 28%. It also includes the, rather the improvement of street lighting.